Okay, now, although this one does have redeemable characteristics, I want to explain why it is garbage all together. Mm -hmm. I'll start with the redeemable stuff. It does have a foreground interest, mid-ground interest, background interest. There is some kind of detail up here in the clouds of the sky. The color balance looks good. It's sharp. That's all okay. Now, first of all, the horizon is not straight, so the entire picture looks like it's going to fall off of its own frame. Second, why did they even choose to cut off the picture right here? Maybe they were trying to frame this house? I don't know. But this house is obviously like the closest and most interesting, and it's completely chopped in half again, right? And then you have... I think that's kind of interesting. If you were going to make the, the horizon not straight, you could at least make this line of John Chow Pierce Street. Didn't do it. Again, it's like they didn't even think about the edges. Look at the edges of the frame. There's absolutely nothing going on in the edges. So, yeah, it's unbalanced, and it sucks. As, what about this one? Which one? This one over here. This one right here? This is a better photo, although the horizon line could be straighter. It should be like a little, a little bit up, but it's a much better photo, right? It leads your eye. you got leading lines in here. It's, they use a fast shutter speed to capture the birds in action. There's a consistent like kind of blue tone. I don't know. It seems like actually maybe they made it cooler than it originally was. This is a decent photograph, and I especially like that guy in the very foreground just looking like a boss. There he is.